Now, I don't think we'll be in that bad of shape, but triple digits is yeah. in the near future. It's here for us today in the forecast, Carmen. You're going to feel like maybe 105 to 106. So you definitely want to make sure your AC is working. They're still uh, just dealing with all of the problems there down in Houston. So what we are tracking on this Monday morning, a heat advisory to start the week. I think we'll have another one going into your Tuesday, possibly on Wednesday. We'll wait to see if the National Weather Service extends that at all. But triple digit heats in my forecast through Wednesday and then the week ends with rain chances and a cold front moving through. So here we are at 518 this morning. Let me go ahead and help you plan the next few days. And today 101 will feel like 106. Tomorrow 102 feeling like 106 for the All-Star game. Thankfully inside uh, the, with Globe Life Field. Wednesday rain chances at 20% go up Wednesday night. But still ahead of this front, we'll make it up to 100. Right now, as you take a look in Arlington, there's Globe Life Field er, off in the distance. It is 79 degrees, already feeling like 82 as you step on out of the door this morning. Same story at DFW. That southerly wind at 7 holding on in your dew point at 70 degrees. Now, the first alert satellite and radar shows not a whole lot ha is happening for us. We're nice and quiet right now, and I don't expect any rain through the day ahead. We're at 77 in Duncanville, 77 Rockwall, 80 in Denton to 80 in Decatur. Across North Texas, same story, temperatures in the upper 70s to the low 80s. It's going to be a muggy day ahead. We'll see 85 degrees at 9, warm up to 88 degrees by 10. We're not done warming up. We make it up to 101 today. Wanted well, to show you the tropics as we watch it during this time of the year. No activity expected in the next seven days. So closer towards home, this area of high pressure is in charge. It's going to back up to the west just a bit. Now that's going to open up the door for some upper level disturbances to work their way on through as we go towards the end of the week and the cold front to move through going into the uh, Thursday time frame. Now that big area of high pressure that we're on the east sides of it this morning shifts its way to the west and we're going to be seeing uh, the heat kind of break down. But heat alerts in place for today. This heat advisory remains in effect until 8 o'clock from noon today because of that feels like temperature up to 106. Now, talking about the front, it's timing looks like Wednesday night into Thursday. The rain's moving in, scattered showers around into Thursday night. Still some scattered showers, maybe some storms popping up. And then off and on on Friday into Saturday. Your weekend, not your best weekend to get outside on the area lakes. I expect to see some rounds of rain in the forecast Saturday into Sunday. Most of Sunday possibly getting some much needed rain in the forecast. How much are we talking about? Well, we could see as much as uh, maybe three to four inches of rain over a four day period off and on with that rain moving through. So your first alert seven day forecast shows how we're hot all the way through Wednesday. Front moves in. Rain chances go up to 40 percent Wednesday night, 50 percent on Thursday. Maybe some stronger storms around Friday 93, Saturday 95. But with more rain on the way on Sunday, uh, Carmen and Madison, a high of only 89 in the forecast.